Good morning! Today is my final interview to know if I got the job or not. So I have a two hour interview today at one o'clock, which is in like two hours. <laughs> Phoenix. <laughs> He's going psycho. And then they'll write me an offer letter if I got the job. So I'm very excited about this. I think I kind of have it in the bag based on the things that they've been saying. But if I, oh my gosh, Phoenix. I'm going psycho on a scratch board right now. If I do get the job, then I want to explain to you guys what exactly the job is and what I'll be doing. I explained it a little bit, but explain more in detail. But let's just go ahead and vlog my day. First, I'm going to go to the gym. Hi, buddy. I just got back from the gym and I'm really kind of worried about Phoenix because we were gone over the weekend. Charlie was watching him and he like kept me up all night last night. All night because he was so excited to see me. He's like laying on my face, meowing in my face. I think he's still kind of in that mood because he's like, I missed you, why'd you leave? Even though it was three days and Charlie was here. Anyway, so I really hope he isn't meowing a lot during my interview. I'll probably just put him downstairs, but he can just walk upstairs and meow at my door. That's what he did last time. So we'll see what happens. Anyway, I'm gross and sweaty and I also only have less than an hour till my interview. So I need to shower. I really need to wash my hair, but I don't know because then it'll be wet. So we'll see. I have 30 minutes to get ready. My hair is wet, makeup's not done, camera isn't set up, let's hustle. I am like literally stressing, just trying to get this done so fast. Plugging everything in, I'm gonna use the big mic this time, and my webcam, I need to make sure Zoom is updated, everything looks good. Okay, looks good. Hello, preparing for my interview. Hello, preparing for my interview. And it sounds good. Okay, let's get ready. I literally forgot he predicted. Okay, it doesn't look like wet wet now. I'll probably like wear it up, so I'm gonna focus on other things. We're gonna do like the most simple makeup. Literally, let's see. Oh, everything is everywhere. And I'm still unpacking for vacation, mascara. We'll just do basic eyeshadow. I'm actually pretty excited for this interview because I really like the people. And then eyebrows. I also was drinking a pre-workout energy drink, like an Alani New, and it made my anxiety through the roof. So don't do that. <laughs> Literally caffeine overload. I don't even know if I've had one sip of water today and I haven't eaten anything. Okay, that's pretty good. I'll blow dry my hair a little bit more too. Boom, you'd have no idea I was rushing. I actually still have 15 more minutes, so I'm actually doing pretty good on time. I added the sweater, it looks a little better. Didn't mean to drop bars. This is what we're working with. I'll shut that door so we have a better background. Okay, literally huge relief. The interview just got pushed back to, I'm not sure if it's 2.20 or 1.20 because we're on different time zones, so I am clarifying that, but it could be in 20 minutes or it could be an hour in 20 minutes, so we'll see. This is actually perfect because I haven't had time to read my Bible, aka making excuses. So honestly, I think that was God right there being like, all right, let's push this interview back, spend time with me. <laughs> maybe, maybe not, but anyway, I'm gonna do my Bible study. And they just clarified it is 20 minutes, so perfect time to read my Bible. Today's date, it is Monday. Today we will be reading, probably won't get through all of it in 20 minutes, but 2 Chronicles 24 and 25, Acts 27, and Psalms 115, one through 10. And I might share a little something something with you. So in Psalms, I read 115 and I love that it's just titled glory to God alone. And then the first verse says, not us, Lord, not us, but to your name, give glory because your faithful love because of your truth. I love that, especially in my circumstance right now. I want to be like, oh, this is because of me and my hard work, which does help. But really, it's God. It's God who has put this job in my lap, who has presented me with these opportunities. Whether I get the job or not, God is gonna put me in the best position for his plan, because his plan is so much greater than mine, and all glory goes to him. The fact that I have the talents that I have is because of him, and the fact that I've even made it this far in the interview process is because of him. So, yeah, I was literally praying this morning, like, I don't know what to say, so just let the Holy Spirit take over. So I think we'll be good. Okay, I'm sitting down, I have about 10 minutes. I'm just gonna get ready. Once again, make sure everything works and my Wi-Fi's good and all that stuff. 
Update time. So obviously I'm done with the interview. I actually ended up having really bad period cramps. So I took a bath and then I realized my bath was disgusting. Like you would have not went to see that water and it's been struggling to drain, but I couldn't get the thing off to like clean it out. So I finally figured that out, it took me forever. And I scrubbed that bathtub clean and now it has never been cleaner. So then I took another like actual good bath, showered off all the nastiness and also went and made lunch before that. So anyway, interview update. It went really well. They're really awesome people. Honestly, we just talked about like our personal lives and who we are, what we believe in, what our life goals are, uh, where we come from, that kind of stuff. So I really enjoyed getting to know them. And then we just talked about a little bit of the details of what the job would be. And then I will know if I have the job or not on Wednesday or Thursday, they're gonna contact me. So I have to wait a couple days. So I'll wait to post this video so that I can update you guys. But let me tell you exactly what the job is. So basically it is a company that has a property management software. So they don't manage your properties, but you can use it as a property manager. So if you own property to lease out your property to or like ma a maintenance center, to like talk with your vendors and talk with your tenants, just really anything that comes with like renting out things you can do on there. They can pay rent on there, all that kind of stuff. So that's really cool because I'm a landlord. But what I would be doing is I would be like the face of their company on social media. So full production of YouTube videos. And then they were talking about about picking my brain about other social medias like expanding into TikTok and stuff like that. So obviously what I love to do is making videos. I'm really excited. We even talked about outsourcing editing so that I can make more content and stuff like that and which part of the process I love and what the process of me making a trial video was like for them. And it was just a really good conversation. I really enjoyed it and I'm really excited about the job. I had a lot of fun making the video. It was a lot more work than honestly these videos just because it was like topics I don't really know about and it was a little more difficult because I had to read off the script. But they said I did a really good job and they're like super impressed with me and I'm like their top candidate but they're also gonna hire two or three other people so it'll be like a little team of us and I'm really excited so now I just have to wait but this is literally my dream job so I think I literally got it like if they're saying I'm their favorite candidate and we like got to know each other really well and I made it this far in the process I don't see any reason they won't hire me I'm it's just kind of a waiting game anyway I was about to say I need to drink water and I realized I'm so thirsty I just like chugged that whole thing I might just play Sims the rest of the night and maybe my boyfriend will come over. Usually I do mentorship on Monday nights, but my mentor is out of town. So I'm kind of just chilling. It is Wednesday. I have a major update. I have a call today. So I got an email and they asked me to schedule a call for this week. So I just scheduled it as soon as possible, which was at three o'clock. It's currently noon. I was drinking a Red Bull because I didn't think I was going to have to get on a Zoom call today. Um, so now I'm all jittery. So I'm eating some pasta, leftover pasta, to try to calm myself down a bit, get full of carbs. I need to change and get ready. Now I'm glad I did my hair already. I'm shaking, like I'm, pretty, I'm so nervous. Like I'm pretty sure I have the job, but it's still so nerve wracking. I'm actually gonna cry how nervous I am. Um, I definitely need to read my Bible right now, eat my food and get ready. I was flipping you off. I was trying to point at my. Yeah. So, this is the vibe. We're gonna add a jacket. I'm kind of like, is it a bit much? Maybe. But I'm a bit much, and I'm also worth a bit much. So, I'm gonna look like it. <laughs> that didn't even make sense. So, this is what we're going for with the look. I don't know about this braid, but I already did my hair, and we're just gonna go with it. Honestly, who cares? <sighs> Let's see, what time is it? So I have like 40 minutes. So I'm gonna read my Bible and try to calm down. I did that, I started preparing for a lesson that I'm gonna be teaching in two weeks at my Bible study. But I just joined the call, I'm just waiting to be let in. I really hope this camera is charged good because I wanna record this, but I should be joining in about two minutes. I left Phoenix in the room this time, so I took off his bell collar. Hopefully he's not gonna be a psychopath. I'm just sitting at the, waiting for the host to start this meeting. Hey. Hi! Awesome, thank you so much. It was so good meeting you guys and getting to know you and I can't wait to be part of the team. Ah! 
So I'm about to go on a hot girl walk with Alyssa, tell her about my job and everything. But yeah, I got the job, guys. I just changed it to my workout clothes. But I don't know why I was so stressed, but they were so awesome. They were so sweet. They were like, gave me the best that they could. And literally insane because they were like, we want you to build out a studio. I told them I'm moving apartments too, so I'll wait till I get there. But they want me to build out my dream studio and they'll pay for everything. And then they're also buying me a new Mac. Um, they're gonna get me like the actual, I forget what they're called because there's different kinds of them. But anyway, like this little Mac and then a new monitor to go with it. So I'm gonna have a really, really nice setup to be able to work for them. And yeah, they're just, I'm so excited. I can't believe I got the job. After my walk, me and my boyfriend just went on a date to go celebrate and he showed up and surprised me with a bouquet of flowers, which is really cute. Tell me how proud of me he is. So before I end this video, I wanted to throw out a few more things about my job. So I should be starting either the first or second week of August. It depends. I was the first person they hired. So it depends when the other people can start. Start, so we all start together at the same time as a team um, so I kind of just spent the last couple days kind of setting up like the direct deposit with my bank account and like all the like onboarding stuff and uh, picking out like the monitor and everything that I wanted so it's been a fun few days I'm really excited to start work and that means I have about mm, two three weeks until I start which actually I'm moving apartments around that exact same time so that'll be a little bit stressful but it's okay um, and then just to clarify like I'm not quitting my YouTube channel I'm still gonna continue. Yes, Phoenix, did you need to tell the vlog something? Say hello. Um, what was I saying? I'm not gonna quit this YouTube channel. I'm still gonna post. It'll probably be more like once a week because I'll kind of just edit when I have free time. So I don't really know what it's gonna look like, but it's gonna look like something. So stay tuned. I love you guys, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye. Oh,